Hey everybody, Robert Seth here for day seven of Vita. Nice to see you again. It's about 10 o'clock. Um, I was working on the cottage again all day today, so I am just getting around to doing my video now. So I'm kind of tired and kind of tired looking. But uh, anyway, I want to I want to do it so I don't miss a day. So anyway, the the question for today is: Do you use an Android or iPhone or Windows phone? And I suppose the question is: What do you think of them? I use a Android phone definitely. I think that uh, iPhones look nicer. Um, I think they. Their menu system is nicer, you know, they're they're more user-friendly and they don't hiccup up quite as much as maybe an Android or a Windows phone does. But I think you get more for your money with an Android phone. They can do so much more. Um, they come in bigger sizes, like I have a, a Galaxy Note 3 and the thing is huge and you can write on it and it's got a Samsung, it's a Samsung, um, and the the digitizer in it is so nice it even makes fatter or skinnier lines depending on how hard you press so it's it's a really nice phone and um, you don't get stuff like that in a Apple phone now one of the other people on Vita that I watched their video today I can't remember her name but um, she had an Android phone and it was a lemon and she tried to bring it back and she's had nothing but headaches trying to get that phone replaced or repaired. So that is the one thing about Apple that I really like is if you do get a bad device, whether it be a computer, iPad, anything, you can bring it back, um, get it replaced. There's just no question about it. There, that's one thing that's excellent about them is their service. There's hands down, there's, no, there's none better. In fact, I have a a video series or a, a blog post series on my website called Mac versus PC and how Mac crushes the competition. So it's, um, and it was based on when I got my first Mac Pro. And um, not too long after I got it, it started doing some funny things. And I'd always had Windows computers before, and Windows computers always do funny things, so I thought it was normal. But when I called them about something else, they said, no, it's not normal. Um, that shouldn't be happening. So bring it in. And it turned out there was a short in the USB bus. And they actually ended up replacing the entire computer because it would have been so time consuming and expensive to replace all the parts that were bad. So it was, it was very impressive. And there was no questions asked, no difficulties, no runarounds. It was just amazing. So, um, in terms of good service and if you think you're going to have a bad product definitely get, I would definitely get Apple then but for phones I like Android. My son has a Windows phone and he's constantly complaining about that thing. I mean it's seems to be right up there with Windows 8 and Windows 8.1 which we're all wondering what Microsoft had in mind when they made that operating system and I kind of feel that way with the Windows phone too so some people like it though, and he seems to like it most of the time, but he does complain a lot about it. So anyway, um, that's how I feel about that, and um, thanks for watching, and I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Good night.